Hey guys, my name is Samsonite, and welcome to Monsters Den, the Book of Dread. Um, I'm probably only going to do one video on this, um, and I don't know how it's been remastered. It's been a really long time. I did play this for like an hour before recording it, just to make sure you know it's the right one and everything. Um, there's a bit of precursor to this. I'll actually go ahead and start playing so I can kind of talk about it as we go. Yeah, I tried... I started playing with this one, but uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and play here. Uh, we'll do the original Monsters Den campaign with many new enhancements. I don't remember the enhancements. I don't remember the old game. It's been a really long time since I played this. Um, uh, I do need a warrior. Uh, my typical loadout is. A warrior, a cleric, um, a ranger, and a rogue. There it is. There's the, oh, yeah, that one. Um, so, um, warrior. Who looks like a warrior? That guy does. And then a ranger, an archer. She looks kind of like an archer. So. Uh, we'll do standard. Uh, the party... Of, these don't matter. You can pause it if you want to read it. Um, this used to be on Addicted Games way back in the day. This is really just like a small little dungeon crawler. It's it's nothing to be sneezed out. Oh, geez, right into... Right into this. Okay, so this is kind of how it works. You click the middle. Oh. Why is that fuzzy? Oh, there we go. Now that's kind of a cool little thing, uh, and then you just you attack with what you're able to do. Uh, the initiative orders over on the right. It's kind of it's a lot like D and D actually. Um, yeah, bitch, liches always use poison. Um, and then you get stuff. Oh, that's actually not bad. Take that loot, and then you you just explore throughout the whole thing. You find loot. Uh, and then down there, it'll it'll tell you if it's better or worse than than what you got. Yeah, and then this guy said it was better for, I think. Oh, which one? Which one are you? Which? Is it b both? Okay. That's fine. So, this was kind of an emotional game to, f to discover that was still around. Um, I don't know. Everyone's kind of got those games. Sorry, you see my ugly legs. Uh, let me, let me make sure that this, uh, eh. um, this was kind of an emotional game to find still existed, uh, cause you know, Flash went away and that's fine. Uh, and I thought this just had went with it. I haven't played this in a while, but I had stumbled across this in my, uh, when I was going through Steam to, like, find stuff to play, like, for the channel, and I found this, and I couldn't believe, I actually did get a little bit emotional, uh, because this, I don't know, it takes me back to a time, uh, like, before my grandfather died, and, and, uh, we would always, that's actually pretty good. Uh, we would always go over my grandparents. Oh, intellect goes to cleric. Equip that. Oh, you have to do it to an equipped item. Got it. Uh, cleric can have... Um, it... It was crazy for me to, to find this because, like I said, I thought it was gone. I do think one of the things that they fixed was this. Like, you can sell, you don't have to go to a certain place to sell anymore. Um, but, like, there was a time, this came out in, I think, 2007, and I found it in 2008. Uh, and my grandfather didn't pass away until 20, the early 2013. So... There was a couple years there where every weekend we would go over to my grandparents' house. We'd watch Friday Night SmackDown, um, WWE Friday Night SmackDown. Uh, we would swim 
because my uh, grandparents had a pool. I would cut the grass. Uh, we'd order Smoke and Joe's. I'd always get a turkey sub, and I'd only have one piece of pizza, and I'd crack open a sun kiss and go with that. And uh, it was before, like, life got adult. You know what I mean? Uh, like, before, you know, everyone's got that time before they had to be an adult. And this game was very much that for me. Like, I would just lock myself in the computer room. And by lock, I mean I would crack the door because I was too afraid to be in there alone because I was, like, 12. I, it came out in 2008. I was born at... Yeah, I was, I was 12. It was before, like, dating became a thing and, and, and uh, drama and, you know, not talking to this family member because of this and all that. And this game was very much brought that back for me when I found it which is really really it's really cool for me uh, because like I don't talk about it a lot but like I don't really talk to my mom anymore uh, I don't well obviously for there, there's a couple family members I don't talk to um I still talk to my grandmother. Obviously, my grandfather passed away. Like, my other grandmother passed away. Like, this was before anything bad had happened. And I would just play this for hours. And hours. And I would sometimes stay up late until, like, 3, 4 in the morning and just play this. I just keep going and keep leveling up and keep going and keep going. I want to see how far I can. Because this is infinite. This is an infinite game. Um... Oh, vampire. I think I can handle it. Uh, I, I just... When I saw that this game wasn't gone, it was really... Uh, really kind of shocking. It was almost sh like a shell shock to me a little bit. I was like, there's no way. And then I looked, and sure enough, here we are. And it's exactly the same, except it looks cooler. It's a little more crisper, and I don't remember the game enough to really be able to compare it to what it used to be. I was telling Michaela about it, and she was like, "That's I'm so glad you found that, because like, I am not really the emotional type. I don't really talk about my emotions that much, uh, which is just the way I choose to be. I like to keep things light if I can. That's just how I am. Um, But like, I couldn't help but kind of make this episode a little bit heavier because that's just what this 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 um game is for me and i played about an hour of it and like i'm not emotional anymore like this is now something i'm playing because i'm back in it like i'm in it to win it bruce might die i could rename them i forgot to uh I just wanted to have this on the channel at some point because this is this game does mean kind of a lot to me and it's just this little game it's like four or five bucks on Steam uh, it's it's very simple very straightforward uh, I just wanted one dungeon crawl worth onto the channel because I think it's important for me and I of course don't mean to make it heavy and uh, it's not my intention. It's just I can't introduce this game to you guys without kind of doing that. Three health generate regeneration. That's not super common, if I remember correctly. This guy's always getting his shit kicked out of him. All right, so enough with like the sappy stuff. Power regeneration. That's really good for cleric. What the hell is this? Plus one strength. Can I put this on here? Cannot equip. Why not? Oh, it's only a cleric thing. Nice. Melee weapon. Wait. Bruce should get the melee weapon first. Yeah, I just... I... I, I like... I don't know. I don't want to keep 
being mushy and stuff. It's just this is a really important game to me. Not because of what it is. It's not complicated at all. It's just very important to me. That's all. I always heal the healer first. I'm going to start using bigger attacks. These guys are kind of mean. Man, they're hitting me with that. Poison. Ah, shit. Joyce. Ah. Dead. Liches are not that easy to take care of if you play D&D. &D. They're like end of the game bosses. So far I've got two things left. I always go over literally every block. I get 100% cleared and explored and all that. I have to. Uh, that's a three. That's a four. Okay, we'll go. We'll go here. All right, we're gonna go straight for it. Ah. Oh shit! I'm in trouble. Damn it! High resistance to physical attack. Ignores armor. 200 damage to undead. Nice. That was a good. That was a good one. Power attack. Wham. All right, Joyce, come on. Oh shit! I'm getting torn up, bro. Nice. Rates down. Ah shit. Lich is down. Vampire's gonna. Yep. Okay, I barely made it. And I'm gonna use one of these rooms. Well, hang on, let me explore further. Okay, there's the exit. But I don't ever exit unless I have to. I'm gonna fight this guy down a member. Should be fine. Dope. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these now. Everyone gets all healed up. All right. Uh, these are better. Well, hang on. I kind of want to put stuff on the cleric because the cleric kind of got murdered. And if the cleric goes down, the whole party will eventually fall. That's light armor, medium armor. Okay, so we got. Can the ranger wear medium? Yeah. Plus three quickness. Put this on you. Does anyone wear light? No. So light armor I can just get rid of then. Okay. Alright, so this is like the boss fight then. Or one of them. Alright, we're gonna... Oh, jeez. This is not good. Two vampire attacks. Shit. Okay. We got this. We got this. Cool. I'm going to start doing as much as I can to, like, spread out the damage. Alright, I killed one. Nice. Um. Oh, that's not for now, though. I'm trying to kill that stupid skeleton. If Joyce can knock that off, it brings the initiative more in my favor, which is definitely what we want. Alright, now it's down to two bone whore. Are these undead? They are! Okay, cool. I still do have... Why is my camera off so much? I didn't realize it was like that. I was having a, 
emotional episode and here we go Joyce is in trouble probably should have renamed them more like personable names nice yeah no I got this and yeah this game can get kind of nuts after a while I haven't explored everywhere yet. Is it this? Not yet. Ooh, hello. Ah, that's right. The the Emporium. That's how you used to be able to... Oh, there's the boss fight. Might not make it. A lot of the early dungeons, you don't make it. Lord Rupert. Insta kill immunity. Okay. We're gonna go straight for him because I don't want him to get any shots off. You never want the big bad to. Oh, shit, I don't think I can avoid it. Yep, here he comes. Ah, oh, see that stuff like that. Oh my god, such a large initiative, and it's not in my favor. Heal or kill Rupert pot potentially. I think I made the wrong choice, but I'm an aggressive player. Okay, Rupert can't super hit everybody any longer. 31, 28. Okay. I wish I could hit the Lich. Two vampire types just don't hit Mildred! Stop hitting Mildred, please! Oh, God. Okay. Shit, and now three more are gonna go. I don't have heals. Ugh. Okay, so I knocked him off, but that's still. Yeah. This is kind of how the early things go. I gotta get rid of that Lich. He just keeps. Poisoning and doing shit. Ah, goodbye, Bruce. Mm. All right. So that is stopped, but I have no way to get. I'm done. Passes. Yeah, I figured. Okay. Party's been defeated in battle. Yeah, 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 whatever. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do that. Well, you know what? I could give one more try if I go for the Lich first. Okay, we're going to we're going to try and hit that Lich. We're gonna try and kill the Lich first. Stop hitting Mildred. Stop hitting Mildred. Homie. I don't think there's any way around losing. Cat. This game brings back a lot of uh, lovely nostalgia that I enjoy very much. It's, uh, yeah, before half the family fell apart, and honestly, you know, before anyone passed away, before I was assaulted, before, before all the bad stuff happened, you know, before adulthood was like, hey, <laughs> you're my bitch, you know, it's, 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 before all the bad stuff happened. Damn, the vampires might not be able to hit me. Well, Scoob, can you please? Yeah. All right. Well, see, that that's going to be the video. It was 20 minutes. 
the next level, and then you start over, and it's, that's just the game. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you go check it out. Apparently, there's, like, more in this series. Apparently, this is, like, a series I didn't know about. Uh, but this is the one that means something to me. So be sure to check in for the next one, guys, because I want to see you there.